Ladies and gentlemen, 96.4% of you are not subscribed. Make sure to subscribe and enjoy the video. Hey, what's going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another Genshin Impact video. If you guys did not know, the new Genshin Impact 1.1 update is coming out very soon. And it's going to release two new characters for your use. Those characters are Zhongli and Child. As well as other 4 star characters that are really important but we're not covering today. A lot of you guys are trying to search up, you know, if Zhongli is worth it, if he's good. If he's better than Zhao, if you should spend gems on him, and I'll help clear that up with this video. Guys, this is Zhao versus Zhang Li. Should you summon for Zhang Li instead of Zhao? Should you save up for Zhao instead of Zhang Li? In my opinion, this is something that's unknown, no one knows it, but I will help you get through this and hopefully we can find a nice conclusion here. Guys, I'm gonna show you a foot in the footage of Zhang Li. I'm gonna show you all the skills and stuff like that in this brief video that we found in the trailer. Of course, it doesn't say his stat. It should give you a brief idea of his skills and what to expect from him. Boats are made for transferring commodities back and forth, and those that come across Lior tend to stay a while. So it is where many things come to settle. This is the largest one we've seen so far. Huh? The Fatui! They're attacking the Glacial <laughs> Let's see. Will the nation that has lost its deity be swallowed up by an ancient malice once more? Farewell, old friend. I am the least adept with a bow, and that is precisely why I must master it. Shouldn't let your guard down! Nothing can be accomplished without rules or standards. Guys, Zhongli is pretty amazing. His skills are very intricate. They're unique. Um, they're gonna be very helpful because he's a Geo character, and not a lot of Geo characters are really good in the game. Of course, you have their main character, which is a really good, in my opinion, for Geo, versus Ning Wang, which I don't think is excellent. She's good, but she's not excellent. She's not S, -S tier. And Noel, I think Noel is brilliant. I think she is good, but I think Zhongli will be ten times better. Not because of not because of healing or support, but maybe because of damage. I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure how we are gonna use him, but it's gonna be exciting to find out. Now, a lot of you guys have seen my Zhao overview. If you have not, it's in the link in the description. If you guys want to watch that, but I'm just gonna be saying Zhongli is not to be missed. Do not miss out on Zhongli. He is an incredible character, and I think you guys should summon for him. Of course, I'm not your parent. You guys can do whatever you want. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to summon for him just because, yes, he is a new character, but he's Geo, and I need Geo. I don't have really good Geo characters other than Traveler. And you guys can give me the argument that Traveler isn't a good Geo character, but in my opinion, he or she is. He can use the skill just like Zhongli, almost for the E ability and their ultimate isn't the greatest but it is still of use. So Zhongli is a polearm user. If you guys have in those in those four star weapons saved up for Zhang Ling, stuff like that, you can use on Zhongli, which is pretty good. Well guys, if you guys didn't know, the best weapon for Zhang Ling, which is also a polearm user, is the prototype grudge as a support unit. But for the DPS you can use the Skyward Spine. However it is a five star our weapon. Alternatively for damage you can use the Crescent Spike which I think is going to be the better use for you in terms of in terms of Zhongli. Even though it seems like he isn't going to be a very damage output character in terms of base damage versus elemental damage. Anyways guys that's it for today's video. Yes we could not go over Zhongli entirely but if we're speaking based off of what we've seen in the trailers I am summoning for Zhongli, no doubt. Do I prefer him over Zhao? As a character, maybe, you know, the 
cool coolness level i don't know about that definitely zhao is very cool however i'm going to be summoning for zhongli and i'll try my best for zhao in the future Zhao's not going to be coming until next year so might as well just summon now and try to collect some more primo gems for the future guys that's gonna be it for the video hope you guys do enjoy this one hope it's useful for you and helped you make your decision yes if you're a free to play character or player it's gonna be a little bit tougher for you to make this decision but i myself am going to be summoning for both and hopefully we do get one of them thank you guys so much for watching see you guys in the next one